In this question, we're already given the, we're not given data, we're given the best fit line and the R value. And they want to know what proportion of the variation in Y can be explained by the variation in the values of X. And this is gonna be R squared. So they give us R and we need to just compute R squared. So I'm gonna type R equals negative 0.4. 419. So this is the R value, R squared. So we could type it as R uh, to the square, to the second, but in Excel it's a little easier to just do R times R um, to get a square. So I'm going to go equals this asterisk this again. So I'm just multiplying by itself to square it. And right there we're putting that in now as a percent. So as a percent, it's going to be equal to what we just did times 100. You can probably do that without multiplying by 100, no problem. Accurate to one decimal place, so I'm rounding up right there. And that's all there is to this problem here. So that just means that 17.6% of the variance is explained by in Y is explained by the X variable.